The Edo State Governor, Senator Mondio Kweholo, yesterday administered the oath of office to newly appointed officials at the ceremony held at the new festival hall in Government House. Edo first, before your personal goal, out of trust and believing you, your hard work, I know you are going to rebuild our educational system. For this security man, I believe in you. You have been a commissioner of police. You are not just a pushover. It is time to pursue the criminals and send them out of our land. Among the appointees were Emmanuel Okobo, who stepped in as Commissioner of Finance, Dr. Padi Yamo as Chairman, State Universal Basic Education Board, and a retired Commissioner of Police, Friday Ibadin, as Coordinator, Edo Security Network. Governor Peholo emphasized the importance of their roles in advancing the state's progress. He urged the appointees to leverage their positions to uplift Edo State, focusing on the revitalization of education and strengthening security measures and enhancing financial management. The governor expressed appreciation for their commitment and hard work, encouraging them to work together towards the state's development and to improve the lives of its residents. The Finance Commission also, you've been there, I know the job. You have not just come in today as somebody we just pick on the street. You have experience in banking. And your experience, you have to bring it to bear to save our land, save our money for us, and let us use the money to develop our state. Okobo, speaking on behalf of the other appointees, pledged to support the governor in achieving his five-point development agenda. I want to first of all thank God for this opportunity to serve this good Provedo state. I also want to thank the executive governor of Edo State, Senator Mordo Pueblo and the deputy governor, Dennis Honor, Right Honorable Dennis Idausa, and the other members of the executive uh, uh, council. Uh, we are committed to help support the governor to achieve his five-point agenda orders so that Edo will be better. And that's our commitment. The Edo State House of Assembly had earlier cleared the appointees after the adoption of the report of its committee on rules and business. Consequently, CP Friday Monday have been cleared as top commander Edo State Security Corps. The CP Monday should be cleared as the security system. So I'm going to say ours. Dr. Padi Yamo and Pastor Mrs. Okbame said that this marks a new era for the education sector while optimizing for the future of educational initiatives in Edo State. I feel excited. Uh, the confirmation was done uh, swiftly and uh, it's time to get to work. Every Edo child is uh, going to have a sense of belonging. Uh, we're going to reduce the out-of-school children. We're going to make sure that they have uh, the right te technological equipment to enable them to learn better. And uh, you know, the, uh, from the reports, uh, one out of three children uh, uh, are out of school. So we're here to make sure that all Edo children are in school. Uh, they learn and they can compete anywhere in the world. I feel so excited. I sit, uh, I sit as a privilege, an opportunity for me to contribute my quota to good education for our wonderful children of Edo State. Having a free, quality, and compulsory education. By the grace of God, as a pastor, we also do our best to bring back morals to all our schools, the junior schools, the basic uh, schools. And we are very sure with our chairman, who is going to be the leader of this team, we are going to have truly a new and a better Edo in the educational system of Edo State. In Government House, Benin City, Momo Anju reporting for FMI Reporters TV.